Welcome back everyone. Well, mostly cloudy and mild conditions continue to be the theme here as we round out the weekend. Few spotty showers possible uh, through the course of tomorrow afternoon, but then rain chances will start to increase on us as we go into Monday and then into Tuesday as well. So we'll discuss that and more here in just a little bit. But first, starting out with the satellite and radar composite across the lower 48 warm front continues to lift northward across Arkansas. They're helping to deliver on some scattered showers and thunderstorms extending into Tennessee as well. And across Across our part of the world, lots of cloud cover out there today. As expected, suddenly winds continue to bring in Gulf moisture, uh, so uh, kind of giving the air more of a humid feel to it, and that's going to be uh, the similar story as we head into our Sunday as well. Mild start temperatures starting uh, in the upper 60s. Might see some patchy fog developing, mainly confined to the coastal parishes first thing tomorrow morning. And then we're looking at mostly cloudy skies once again for our Sunday afternoon. Model not showing much here, but with low level moisture continuing to increase and a little bit of daytime heating out there. Wouldn't be surprised if we saw a few spotty showers developing through the course of the afternoon. Nothing that would be overly heavy or cause many issues, but a hold rain chances at around 30% or so. Temperature is going to be on the milder side, upper 70s, close to 80 degrees tomorrow afternoon and still going to be dealing with those breezy subtly winds as well. Cold front starts to approach from the north as we head into Monday. I think we'll be stuck in the warm sector long enough to where we actually still top out in the lower to mid 70s for Monday afternoon. And then some scattered showers, maybe a few rumbles of thunder on the way for late Monday afternoon going into Monday evening. But Monday's not necessarily looking at a complete washout or anything like that. And that front starts to drop into the Gulf of Mexico as we head into Monday night. And then we're going to have to wait on our next upper level disturbance to approach the area as we head into Tuesday to help to start to push all of this out of the area, but still plan on some scattered light to moderate showers through the Tuesday morning time frame, perhaps extending into the early afternoon period as well. But I think by late afternoon on Tuesday, the bulk of this shower activity starts to push out of here, but it will be slightly cooler afternoon highs on Tuesday, only going to be topping out in the middle 60s. Rainfall wise again, models heading at around a half an inch to or to an inch or so, but we'll continue to watch those trends through the course of the weekend and we're not looking at any severe weather as well. So again, the model not nearly as aggressive on fog for tomorrow morning. Reason uh, being suddenly winds going to be a little bit more elevated by tomorrow morning, so that should uh, help to break up the fog potential at least a little bit, uh, keeping the thickest of the fog confined mainly along the coastal parishes into southwest Louisiana, but still some patchy fog possible in spots first thing tomorrow morning, so just keep that in mind if you have to be out on the roadways. And then kind of similar story as we head into our Monday morning as well. So temperature wise, again, mid to upper 60s first thing tomorrow morning, but then warming up into the upper 70s to right around 80 degrees for our Sunday afternoon under mostly cloudy skies. Similar story again heading into Monday with those temperatures uh, starting out in the upper 60s and again still think we briefly get into the lower and mid 70s on Monday afternoon with cooler air lurking not too far behind. That'll uh, get into the area again later on Monday night going into Tuesday. But in the short term again mild and muggy conditions out there tonight here across Acadiana mostly cloudy skies in place. Some areas of patchy fog developing later on tonight, mainly along the coastal parishes, mid to upper 60s for an overnight low. Mostly cloudy and mild conditions uh, dominating still as we head into our Sunday afternoon highs, upper 70s to near 80 degrees. Staying breezy as well. We'll see suddenly winds at around 10 to 20 miles per hour. And again, a few afternoon showers trying to develop, but again, nothing overly heavy or causing too many issues. Still getting into the lower and mid 70s there on our Monday with rain chances arriving for Monday afternoon going into Monday evening with scattered showers still lurking around as we head into our Tuesday, but temperatures relatively uh, pretty close to normal for the better part of next week. Another system uh, pro Approaching late next Thursday going into Friday and that should help to clear things out as we head into the following weekend.